My name is Scott McVetty, and I'm here to talk today about Cash Mob Chilliwack. I am Dale Johnson, and this is Cash Mob Chilliwack. I love Chilliwack because of the people. I, I've been in many different cities over the course of my life, and the people in Chilliwack are just a little more genuine and a little more sincere. And those are the same people that are running the local businesses here, and those are the people that we would love to support with Cash Mob Chilliwack. So I saw a story about Cash Mob, and uh, I said to my wife, you know, what a great idea. We should try and do something like that ourselves. And, uh, we pitched it to a friend, Scott and his wife, and, and they were in full support, so away we went. Uh, we set a date a month in advance and made the agreement with each other that we would spend no money and uh, we would just do a total grassroots type promotion to see where we can get with it. So, you know, at this time we've got 100 plus people liked us on Facebook and, and we're hoping to have a huge turnout on, on June 1st at 7 p.m. So the idea of Cash Mob is it takes all the good aspects of a flash mob without the singing and dancing and combines it with the shop local philosophy which just encourages people to shop at the locally owned and operated stores within their own communities. Every election cycle uh, for City Council in Chilliwack always asks the same question for you know, as long as I've known, what are we going to do about downtown? Uh, what are we going to do about the unique character and businesses in this town? And the answer always seems to be looking for government to answer. Uh, the question. I think that it's up to the people who live here to support the business. The first Chilliwack cash mob will be on June 1st and we're all meeting at the park at the end of Mill Street and Victoria here in Chilliwack at 7 p.m. and once the group converges we will announce the store that we're going to be supporting that night and en masse everybody will proceed to the store and, and spend at least twenty dollars at the store and after that we're going to have uh, an after party at a local establishment where we can have a celebratory drink and, and meet some new friends. So for everybody who sees this video, uh, first off, like us on Facebook, uh, share it with your friends, let people know about our event. Second, get out there and support local business. If you can't make it to the cash mob, it doesn't mean you can't come down the next day or the day before and still shop downtown. Show the local merchants that you care.